All right. This week, I bring a message from time. Zer is on Nessus. Watcher's grave, usual spot. We're going to go ahead and look at the guns he's got. He's got a true prophecy. It's not awful PvE roll, honestly. Um, me personally, I'm not going to grab that. Uh, Nature of the Beast. Honestly, pretty decent roll if it loads here. Snapshot, Rangefinder. Extended Mag. It's alright. Good, good, uh, good perks. Bad barrels, in my opinion. Ooh, Volpecula. Now, I'm a fan of this gun. I really do like this roll. It's got a ton of stability. Absolutely no range. I do not love that. But it's glitched. Impact. Grab that this week. It's got an impact glitch. Just grab it. Uh, far future. The perks are terrible. Don't even look at it. Uh, so Joiner's Tail. Rabbit Hood Surrounded, I guess, isn't awful. The barrels are pretty good. You can get a lot of handling and a good amount of range. Um, I might grab this. I'll, I'll grab it. Might, might use it. Uh, this sword is not good. And this grenade launcher is honestly not good. I, I, I don't know if rapid fire frames are good anymore, but I don't think it's any good. Legendary armor. Decent resilience and strength if that's what you're into, but terrible recovery, terrible intellect. I wouldn't grab that. Okay, chess piece, if you don't have anything better, but I'm not grabbing that. Um, not enough space for the boots. Pretty good boots. Grab those if you don't have a better roll. I do, so I don't need to grab them. And then, if you don't care about intellect, and you are a disciplined resilience roll, go ahead and grab this helmet. Sure. Exotic Ingram, Queen Breaker's Bow this week knucklehead armentarium with a lot of resilience I'm gonna grab it starfire protocol with a lot of resilience and discipline uh, opening shot of Hawkman there's better rolls I would not grab this one personally tons of handling tons of handling so actually maybe you do grab this one 96 handling handling Hawkman huh it's pretty good this week. Fourth time's the charm. Honestly, a slept on perk for this gun. If you hit the head, it's pretty good. Good handling. Decent range. Terrible stability. But all around, these two are really not bad. Tons of handling on this Hawkmoon. Insane Hawkmoon, honestly.